Okay, so um, I just saw this article that came up on my phone on my newsfeed. Uh, it says November 16th, 2015. The headline is Liberals' Heads Spinning as NASA Releases New Images. Antarctica is Growing, Not Shrinking. And I just have to say that, I mean, we all know that the flat earth topic has basically blown up on the internet this year, you know? But it, it's funny to me how right when it blows up, it's they come out with like some of the most supposedly authentic NASA imagery we have from of Antarctica at the bottom of the globe, you know, like proving to you that the flat earth isn't real, but like, is this not the most fake thing you've ever seen in your life? I mean, look at look at this. Just look at it for like two seconds. Look at that. Okay? It looks like a someone drew that on a piece of paper. Look at this, okay? Look. If the, if this line right here is supposed to be the atmosphere, if that's supposed to be the atmosphere, then these mountains are like literally outside of the atmosphere. Okay? That's the atmosphere. These mountains are outside of the atmosphere. The atmosphere. Okay? Which is nuts, alright? That's just crazy. Oh, and by the way, there's like four clouds in the whole continent. The whole bottom half of this continent of, I believe that's South America, is like, you know, four clouds. You know, and look at this. Look at that. Okay? And then what are these, like, random, you know, white, like, milk stains in the middle of the ocean? Just, like, randomly continent-sized milk stains. Like, white streaks. I mean, I get that they, they're, they're maybe thinking it's a, uh, um, you know, more shallow ground, more shallow uh, sea level. That it's a little bit lighter, but I mean, please. I mean, please. And, and this is what always got me. Even, even when I wasn't a flat earther, or was even considering it, look at this circle, dude. Look at this circle. I mean, if you want to talk about made in a computer software imagery of a perfect mathematically correct circle, I mean, wow. Look at that. It's like, okay, how can that happen in nature? That's There's no way, you know? So apparently someone's wrong. You know, Neil deGrasse Tyson is saying it's an, an oblate spheroid. Okay? This is not an oblate spheroid. This is no pear-shaped. Someone's wrong. But, you know, this is one of the most... I'm shelled, you know, it, it comes down to the point of, like, of kids, you know, someone, like, kids fighting, like, you know, someone wants to ride shotgun, and the other kid runs up and goes, get out of my seat, stupid, uh, I'm running shotgun. It's almost like, okay, yeah, like, the flat earthers say, the earth is flat, it blew up on the internet, and then right after that, NASA comes out with a photo saying, no, you're stupid, Antarctica is at the bottom of the earth, see? It's almost like, okay, wow, like, the just the timing of this alone, I mean, forget the picture, just the timing of it, it's just blowing my mind, okay? It's it's almost comes to the point of ridiculous at this point. It's coming to the point of ridiculous. That's what it is, okay? So, wow. And one of the biggest things is that, the, uh, by the way, those mountains are outside the atmosphere, which is just... <sighs> it's just nuts, dude. I don't know how we've gotten this far, but at least, you know, for one of the first times, at least they put some uh, stars in the background, you know? All the other photos they've ever had have stars in the background. And oh, by the way, there's no, uh, there, there's no, uh, satellites anywhere. Alright? Let's just look this up real fast, okay? Okay. Alright, check, check this out for like two seconds. This is what they're telling you you should be seeing, okay? Space junk, space junk space junk, how much space junk is in our atmosphere, that's what you should be seeing. This is what they're showing you. What you should be seeing. What they're showing you. I basically don't have anything else to say at this point, but, uh, you know, just wow.